Chris Langris and Marcus Ellis ready for another final at the multi-sport event. Uh, Chris, uh, of course, you can keep smiling for, for the rest of the day here, but uh, what do you think of the performance? Uh, yeah, you know, we're both pleased the way we played. There was a few patches where we didn't stick to the game plan quite as well, but I think throughout 75% to 90% of the match, we, we stuck to the game plan that we decided on before, and I think it was effective for us today. And I think we performed... Uh, we performed well today and we're both you know really pleased because the Dutch you know they're a very strong pair so to beat them like we did today we're you know really really pleased Marcus looking at tomorrow finals against the Danes uh, you've met them twice before lately at the Sudirman Cup too uh, that was a true thrill can we expect the same tomorrow uh, yeah I mean I hope so um, we know that if you know we we place a similar level to how we did in the Sudirman Cup then you know we have a great chance uh, we're not going to concentrate too much on on them and what they're doing because you know at the end of the day if we perform well we know we've got a shot Chris there's one thing I've always been thinking about at 18-15 in the second game full focus you guys in the sound speaker we hear Scatman John and it's like uh, it's a party going on in the stands do you as a player realize that's music going on outside of the court or are you so fully focused that you don't realize anything? To be fair, I didn't actually hear that. Yeah, I, um, I heard it, but it's, yeah, yeah I kind of just thought it's a little bit strange. Yeah, But, but is it a distraction of, for, for, for you guys, uh, or basically not for you, Chris, because you didn't hear it, but I'm for you? I'm used to all sorts of noises because I've got kids, so I think I've, I've managed to sort of block out a lot of noises, especially at night when they cry. Um, no, but I, I, I don't know. I didn't even hear it. But I think because, you know, we go to Indonesia, they scream and shout and there's all sorts of noises. So I think uh, you managed to block them a lot out. But I guess Marcus still got good hearing. Yeah, I mean, I, I wouldn't say it was much of a distraction. Um, like I said, I just heard it and I thought it was slightly strange timing to have it on. And then it cut off after about 10 seconds. But, you know, it's, it's like you said, you, tr you train yourself to not get distracted. But the national anthem tomorrow, if you hear that, I suppose it's okay to have some music in the in the venue. Yeah, I'd, you know, I'd really like to hear that. That'd be that'd be yeah, that'd be quite a a nice a nice song to hear. Yeah.